All right, this video will be on threat versus risk versus vulnerability and uh, the differences between the two of them. So I'll go over a threat real quick here. Um, a threat is essentially anything that could act on uh, the organization's assets and cause uh, damage. So a geological threat could be a hurricane, a flood, an earthquake, um, anything that could physically damage either resources or um, assets of the organization. Physical threats, uh, a car crashing into a building, um, something like that. And a cyber attacker uh, is what we're most concerned about in IT. Um, it's what we tend to think about as being the most destructive, although geological threats and other threats can also be just as detrimental. Um, a vulnerability would be something that could be exploited in order to cause damage, uh, steal data, uh, anything like that. So an unlocked door uh, is an example. Unpatched software could be detected and exploited potentially by a cyber attacker. Uh, no antivirus software, either on your home machine or on office machines, uh, could leave them open to malware which could compromise data. Um, so risk is essentially kind of a combination of both those. Uh, the rate at which a vulnerability would be exploited is the uh, annual rate of occurrence. So the occurrence of this threat or this vulnerability, uh, the single loss expectancy, what you would expect to be the dollar amount for uh, a single attack or a single event, um, what that would be expected, and the annual loss expectancy. So to find the annual loss expectancy, we're going to look at the annual rate of occurrence and multiply that by the single loss expectancy. Um, that will give us our annual loss expectancy. So for example, if there's a 50-50 chance that um, your building could flood this year, and if it does flood, it's going to cause a million dollars in damage. We want to look at uh, budgeting for about $500,000 a year. Um, in a later video, we'll talk more about the uh, ability to reduce risk through mitigation, acceptance, avoidance, and risk transfer.